Well, you may have noticed new roadside improvements on the Courtney Campbell Causeway, but at what cost? It turns out decorative boulders cost you thousands, and that's just the start. Tonight, Mark Douglas shows us what it costs because, hey, you paid for it. Hi, Mark. Hi, Stacy. As you can imagine, public park improvements don't come cheaply, and we found out that's also true along the scenic trail on the Courtney Campbell Causeway. We now have the price list, and tonight, we'll break it down for you. The Courtney Campbell Trail is fast becoming a go-to spot for cyclists and pedestrians alike. And for those who need a rest stop now and then, there are 10 new shelters stretching from Ben T. Davis Beach all the way to the Hillsborough County line. They're nice, really nice. Those shelters, pads, and the quirky Flintstone furniture cost you $279,000. You don't mind the Flintstone furniture? No. Hey, anything's an improvement. I think it's nice. The lightning rods cost $10,000. Add in $9,500 for bike racks, $154,000 for all of these new palm trees, and $73,000 more to buy, ship, and install all of those decorative boulders. Total cost paid by Hillsborough County taxpayers with all the other line items works out to $878,000. It is nice, but I don't know if that's $800,000 worth of nice. Just like Melinda Shannon, James Jordan admires the new look, but he liked it better before he heard the price. $878,000. Wow. Wow. Project managers tell me the trail improvements actually came in about $300,000 under budget. A real bargain in their book. Maybe it's just a mild case of taxpayer sticker shock for frugal folks like James Jordan to find out what things really cost. It's a lot of money in them. The city of Tampa handled design and construction on this project. Hillsborough County paid for it, and the Florida DOT will assume responsibility for upkeep. You know, Stacy, it's kind of like that new purse my wife just bought. She <laughs> loves it. It looks great. I'm happy to pay for it, but I'm not so sure I want to hear about the cost too much. You don't Let's want to know exactly no, what it costs. No, no. What about that Flintstone furniture? I wanted to ask you first, is it comfortable, and why that look? <laughs> It was comfortable for a moment. I'm not sure I'd want to sleep there, but maybe that's the point. They don't want people sleeping there. You know, they say it was supposed to blend in with the natural environment. It does that. They say it's supposed to be sturdy enough to handle storms, and sure enough, it's rock solid, just it like is. the Flintstones. It is. I like <laughs> it. Thank you, Mark.